month's Wonderly theme is curate, and so I want to curate some of my favorite book to movie adaptation trailers. Okay, with one exception, there is one that is not a book to movie thing, but it's very like young adult y. So I thought I'd throw it in because it looks really good, and I've seen the trailer at least three times. So good. Of course, we have Catching Fire, which is my favorite book out of the series, and so of course I am twice as excited as I should be. The costume design looks amazing, everything looks amazing, and I just recently actually saw the Hunger Games movie for the first time this week, and so fresh eyes on this whole thing. I've read all the books, I've read all those, so you can't hate me for that, but I did take some time to just kind of like let the fandom simmer down a little bit before watching The Hunger Games and so glad I did and I'm super excited for Catching Fire because it looks like it's going to be a really good film and just all around amazing. And then we have the movie that seriously made me flail in the theaters. I believe I was watching um, The Host when I saw this one and it is Percy Jackson and the Sea of Monsters. I think the movie is just called Sea of Monsters but it's from the Percy Jackson and the Olympian series and you know first one General consensus is that it wasn't that great, you know, just a general, yeah. I saw like 15 minutes of it and was like, no, I'm not watching the rest of this. Uh, but this one looks just amazing. It does. Nathan Fillion? Yeah, that happens. I know he's in the book for a short amount of time, so maybe they'll give him more screen time because he's a little bit moved up in the ranks with the, but maybe not. Who knows? And, um... Just the visual looks really good and everything and so it looks it looks amazing and yes God it looks so good. I know this book to movie adaptation already came out, but seriously, again one of these trailers that just really stuck out to me when I first saw it and every time I saw it was the Beautiful Creatures trailer, um and it was on iTunes and stuff like that. But uh basically blew my freaking mind. Uh movie but the trailer, yes, it got me. And the last movie is one that I just, I need to see it. It looks like it's going to be like really good for the soul and everything else. And it's The Kings of Summer and it has uh, Nick Offerman and forget his wife's name. She plays a lot of characters in a lot of shows. She was on uh, Will and Grace, that lady. And um, there's a lot of, uh, Alison Brie is in this movie. There's several other people. Um, Moises... Something. He was on the Disney Channel for a long time on Hannah Montana. He's in this movie. A lot of great other people are in this movie. Um, some people that I don't recognize. But the general storyline is that these kids have technically kind of like run away from home and they've built themselves some sort of like fort in the woods. But it looks really good. It looks amazing. Not the fort. The movie. Because it looks like right amount of hilarity and right about serious and so again like I said good young adult e kind of film and so yes so that's my wonderly curates book to movie slash other movie trailers and so I hope you enjoyed it and I'm gonna list some other videos below for people who made some videos like this whether they be wonderly channels or people who just made wonderly curates things channels. So if you wouldn't mind, I would like to know your favorite book to movie trailer. I would like to see what it's all about and things like that. Share the feels, share the love of movies um, that have come from books because there's a ton. There's really a lot. Seriously, think about it. It's a ton.